Hello, hello. Um, the tutorial today for Show Tip Tuesday is going to be how to build your own pop up um, within Show It instead of embedding it or using any kind of a plugin. Um, it's actually pretty simple, and the only limitations are really that it can, it's not timed, so it's not timed as in like you can't set it to pop up after a certain time, and you can't really set it as an exit intent pop up. It's going to be, um, shown based on when your user scrolls onto a certain canvas. So let's get started. Um, so whichever page you are wanting to add it to, um, let's go ahead and add a blank canvas here at the bottom. Um, you can go ahead and build it, um, design it out however you'd like. I'm, gonna, I'm going to build something extremely simple today um, just for the sake of this tutorial, but obviously you can get however creative you'd like. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that. see here we'll do a colorful today this is a pop-up I'm gonna grab a for example like a uh, an embedded form you can put those on there which is great for like a newsletter sign up um, I'm gonna grow go grab one of those off of here just for the sake of showing you Make this pretty small. There we go. Drag this guy down. So you definitely can integrate embeddable things into your pop-ups as well. It's basically just another canvas, and we're going to make the background um, not have any background at all. And then we're going to make it hidden to start over here, and then select when we want it to pop up. Um, so that's kind of the thought process behind this. Um, I'm going to add an icon um, to make it so that uh, the user can X out of it. And I'm just going to make this white for right now. So now we've designed our basic pop-up. This is how I want it to look. It's not super fancy, but um, it will work for the sake of this tutorial. So the next thing I'm gonna do is uh, either drag this all the way up so there's nothing below it, or you can change this initial height to one. The next thing I'm gonna do is set my stacking order to 10, or whatever is higher than anything you have on your site because we want this to overlay on top of the entire site when it pops up. The next thing I'm gonna do is have this sticky to top and then make it hidden to start because I don't want this showing up right away uh, when people first go on the site. I wanna wait until um, they scroll down a little bit and then it's gonna pop up. Um, obviously you can do this on mobile too. I haven't done this on mobile. Um, but it's the exact same idea. You would just create this on mobile and then um, make the, the um, settings the same. Um, so next I am going to um, go up here and select which uh, canvas I want this to pop up on. So I'm going to have this pop up here. So I'm going to select this canvas and then I am going to select scroll actions. So now I want to trigger on screen. I'm going to show a canvas and I want to show this new canvas. So I'm actually going to set it. Oopsies. I'm actually going to name it pop up. Pop up. Okay, so let's do that again. Here, select pop up. You can have it trigger only once or you can have it trigger anytime they roll over it. I'm going to select trigger once just for the sake of this. And then the next thing I'm going to do is set an action uh, on the X that it's going to hide the canvas so that it'll hide it uh, when they select that X. Okay, now we are going to preview it and see if it worked, which it should. There it is. So it wasn't exactly on this canvas, but it's pretty close. And then, of course, it's going to... Um, click out there. So I'm going to do that one more time just to show you. So you can kind of play with how it shows up. Um, it's not exactly the right way. I could also change um, 
where that pops up if I want to move this down a little bit on that canvas. And since it's sticky to top, it'll show up more in the middle mouth there. That looks a little bit better. But you can see that these work great. Um, uh, anything that it, you do pop up into here, um, it's just like another canvas. So this is a really great tool to use um, for pop-ups instead of having to use an outside um, integration. Hope that helps. And as always, let me know if you have any questions. Pop it in the comments.